The Timeless Layers of Carnelian The bands of Carnelian are more than just patterns. They are geological time, written layer by layer. Each band shows us a story of how silica-rich fluids filled a volcanic cavity, depositing minerals over thousands, or even millions, of years. These layers didn't form quickly. In fact, the process could take decades for a single band to develop, depending on the environment. Imagine this. Deep underground, a pocket forms in cooling volcanic rock. Silica-rich water seeps into the cavity, carrying dissolved minerals like iron. Over time, as the water evaporates or cools, silica begins to solidify, forming a thin layer of chalcedony. But the earth isn't a machine. It shifts, changes. A new flow of fluid arrives, slightly different in composition, leaving another layer, a new band. This process repeats, over and over, sometimes interrupted for thousands of years before it starts again. The colors of the bands, those fiery oranges and reds, come from the presence of iron. When conditions are just right, iron oxidizes, staining the silica and giving carnelian its signature warmth. Every band is a marker of a unique moment, a chapter in the stone's creation. Large, complex specimens of carnelian, like the one you see here, might have taken millions of years to form. Each layer represents patience, pressure, and the slow movement of time. The druzy crystals, the sparkling quartz inside, formed during the final stages of the cavity's life. As the flow of silica-rich water slowed to a trickle, tiny quartz crystals began to grow, filling the empty spaces with their brilliance. Carnelian is just a stone, yes, but it's also a piece of Earth's history. Every polished band, every sparkling druzy point, reminds us that beauty can take time. When you hold a piece like this, you're holding millions of years of geological development captured in a single rock.